This video is the first in a series about creating search statements. In this video, you will learn about breaking down your topic into keywords in order to search for library resources. So perhaps you're working on a research paper and with your professor's help, you've developed your topic into a question. How are librarian stereotypes in popular culture impacting college students' willingness to ask for help in the library? How are you going to search for articles or books? Maybe we can put this entire question into the database search box. Well, you could try, but I don't recommend this strategy. Databases don't really like full sentences, so you'll either get way too much information or nothing at all. Instead, pull out keywords and phrases from your topic. Thinking about your topic, how are librarian stereotypes in popular culture impacting college students' willingness to ask for help in the library? Librarian stereotype would be one, also popular culture, as this is what's impacting our population. Lastly, I would select college students. These three key phrases, now highlighted in yellow, are those that really need to show up in a resource for it to be useful. We aren't done yet though. Another important part of finding keywords or phrases is to consider related words. Those that are broader and narrower, or even synonymous with the keywords we pulled out from our research question. In this example, our first key phrase is librarian stereotype. Related but broader terms could be library stereotype or library, while related but narrower terms could be librarian image or college librarian. You can probably think of a few more, but this is a good start. The next two keywords, popular culture and college students, also have a number of broader and narrower words, including media representation, pop culture, movies or literature, and students, young adults, or freshmen. Now we have a good selection of keywords and phrases, and we can start searching the library for resources. Simply pick one term from each column and use them in the library's big red box. For example, college librarian, movies, and college students. Notice how throughout this process, I've kept terms like college librarians in quotation marks. This is called phrase searching, and it's important to use when looking for two or more words that need to show up together to be useful. To see the big red box in action, or watch the next video in this series, Piece Together Keywords, check out research guides and tutorials from the library's homepage.